hey guys before starting this video i want you to subscribe my channel and do hit that bell icon so you will never miss our videos Hey guys, I'm Shreya back with another video and in this video I'm I'm going to talk about new smartphone recently launched by Motorola named Moto Z2 Play. So, yes, Motorola has launched their new smartphone Motorola Z2 Play for $499, approximately 32,100 Indian rupees. So, if you talk about the specifications, so this smartphone got the Snapdragon 626 under the hood and it got the 5.5 inch full hd display with 2.5d curved glass and a corning over a glass on the top of it and if you talk about the ram management so it got the 4 gigs of ram coupled with the 64 gigs of internal storage and the phone also comes with the 3 gigs ram variant coupled with the 32 32 gigs of storage option but in india it may be not launched so If we talk about the graphics section so it got the Adreno 506 GPU and the connectivity is 4G VoLTE Wi-Fi Bluetooth 4.2 GPS USB type C port is over there and the phone also comes with the NFC so if you use NFC in your day-to-day -day transactions so you can use that too and if we talk about the Moto Mode's connectivity so yet it got those dots at the back so you can connect any modes as you had connected or you have in Moto's Moto Play Moto Z Play so those modes are connectable in the Moto Z Play 2 and if you talk about the camera so it got the same 12 megapixel sensor that has been seen on the Moto G5 Plus with larger aperture of 1.7 and it has the laser out of focus technology with dual led flash and the sensor is 1.4 pixel size and the other features are like geo tagging touch focus face detection panorama auto hdr and much more and the ca rear camera is capable of shooting 1080p videos and the front facing camera is of 5 megapixel and it has dual tone dual led flash in it if we talk about the battery so it has a 3000 mah of battery and that is a uh, drawback because in Moto Z Play it has the 3510 mAh of battery but in Moto Z2 Play it has only 3000 mAh of battery and it's kind of degradation to their new variant and it's interesting to see how battery efficient this device is because it got Snapdragon 626 the successor of Snapdragon 625 a very power efficient chip so maybe that's why they wanted to slim the size of the smartphone because now the Moto Z2 Play it only measures 5.9 mm so that's why they had to you know cut down the battery because they wanted to make this device more slimmer and they had added the Snapdragon 626 that's why maybe the battery would give the better results but i think 3000 mAh is kind of unfair with 5.5 inch full hd display but maybe it it will gonna work with Snapdragon 626 and if you talk about the pricing detail in india so it's not confirmed yet but according to me it should be approximately around 26 to 27000 but this thing is really pricey the uh, you can say in accordance to their specification in my opinion if you want a good device and if you can you know compromise with the camera performance you should go with the Redmi Note 4 and if you want to go with a great camera device you can go with the Moto G5 Plus 2 with a budget so if you had a extra budget for Moto Rola and you are you know you have a brand you know the brand thing in your mind that we want the Moto thing so you can go with this device because it's too costly in comparison with the features they are providing with their Moto Z2 Play so in my opinion you should go with the Redmi Note 4 and the Moto G5 Plus maybe you were thinking why i'm suggesting that because you know it's now they are kind of old they are 3 to 4 months old but the thing is these those devices are really powerful yet and i think it's 
you know it's kind of unfair to say that because i don't wanted anyone to be in you know in the dilemma that they should go with the motor z2 play right now because motor z2 play is kind of too or maybe i'm not that sure because they launched their smartphone with 499 dollar price tag so maybe it'll gonna you know have a huge cost and if you want a great device you can go with moto g5 plus for sure and redmi note 4 both devices are awesomeness powerful and like i don't have words for them they are really great in a budget of in a tight budget of you know 15 to 16 thousand so you can go with the moto g5 plus or redmi note 4 instead of going with the moto z to play and if you have to go with the moto so you can go with it if you have you know a normal budget of going with 26 to 28 thousand rupees so that's it guys hope you like this video and if you have any query about the smartphone you can comment me down below and if you like this video don't forget to hit the like and do subscribe our channel for more techie videos like this that's it peace out